What is up you guys and uh welcome back to the channel so this is going to be a different kind of video you know and it's like something that's been like really been really weighing on my mind that i've noticed lately in the world and it's like there isn't enough love in the world like people get hated for their race their beliefs their sexuality who they are as a person what they did in the past like i don't see how that makes any sense man in order for this world to be a better place we all need to love each other you know what i'm saying we all need to care for each other to evolve i'm not really religious because i have my reasons like there is a higher power and i do believe i'm not very like i can't hate someone because of their sexuality that's another thing in this country that's the one thing in America is like, even in the world, you can't be open about what you really are. And I have a lot of friends who are, you know, lesbian, gay. And when people find out that I'm friends with them, they want to assume that I'm the same, even though I love women. I love women. But I don't think and I don't believe that if you're friends with somebody who is attracted to the same sex, I don't believe that you shouldn't hang out with them. That is your friend. You know, I grew up with these people. You know what I'm saying? I grew up with these people. We grew up together since the time we were kids all the way up until we're adults now. And there's no way in hell that I could ever judge someone because of their sexuality or what they like. Because that's none of my business. I mean, let's be real. That's none of our business. I can't get mad at someone who believes in something else that I, be that I don't believe in. Because that's their opinion. That's their belief. All I've been seeing for the longest now, you know, last year and this year is just hate. Even like even like even when it comes to politics, people they hate they hate. They just hate people who aren't on the same side as them. Why is there sides? Why are there sides? Why can't we just be people who just love each other? Why can't we just love one another? Who gives a fuck what you look like? Who cares what your skin color is? Who cares where you're from? Who cares what your religious belief is? You know, people, if you don't believe in something, that's fine. But don't put nobody down just because you don't believe in what they believe in, man. We all have our own consciousness. We all have our own thoughts. You know what I'm saying? We all think differently. We're all wired differently. We, some people deal with more than others. But instead of putting people down, we should be uplifting each other. We should be uplifting each other. We should be helping each other. When you see someone down, help them. Because one day that will be paid back to you. I see a lot of people who put, you know, who put down homeless people. I see a lot of people who make fun of people who have went through something. I see a lot of people who make fun of people who have been arrested over something. I see a lot of people who make fun of people, you know, because of their sexuality or because of who they like. You know, like a, like a guy who's in good shape dating a woman who's maybe overweight. Or maybe the opposite, a woman who's in good shape dating a guy who's a nerd. Or, you know, a weeb or something. Like... None of that exists, man. It's all about what's in here. It's all about what's in here in your heart. We don't have, like, th like this world is starting to lose the understanding of love. And it sucks. It really does. We need to love each other. We need to be there for each other. Not being judgmental. We need to stop being judgmental. We need to stop... Letting our own personal beliefs get in the way of our friendships. We need to stop letting that stuff... We need to let go of what society says. Society doesn't exist in my eyes, man. Because I believe in what I believe in. But I'm not going to put down any of my friends or anybody else that I know that I love dearly inside my heart that are like family because of what they believe in. They can believe what they want to believe and I'm going to believe what I want to believe. And it's when you come to an understanding of that... That you just don't judge people because of what they believe in, but you judge because of what's in their heart. That's when this that's that's when the world will become a better place, man. And to anybody out there, anybody who has a dream out there, anybody who has any doubts in their head about what they want to be, take that out of your head. Take it out of your head. Speak it into existence. I've been doing YouTube for almost three years. 
since my father passed away, and that's something I don't really talk about on this channel, but when he passed away, my whole world paused. I didn't want to live anymore. I didn't want to even have a family. I didn't want a girlfriend. I didn't want nothing. I just wanted to die because I lost the one person in my life who was there for me. You know, granted, my mom was there for me, my siblings too, but the one person who understood me and I understood them as much as they understood me was taken from me. And I could have gave up, but I didn't. I didn't. I started this channel, and I made my dream come true. I have people who follow me, who love me on this channel, people who watch my videos, and I'm not even trying to, you know, like flex, but I finally got monetized, which was my goal from the beginning, because I wanted, I want to give my family a better life. I want to give my mom the things that she couldn't give us when we were kids. Because my mom and dad struggled when they came to this country. They struggled. My family came from a country that was in war because of their beliefs. My people were killed because of something petty. And I don't believe in war at all. I have respect for the soldiers. I have respect for all of that. But I do not have respect for war. Because at the end of the day, when you start a war and when you do something like that, innocent bystanders... Innocent people, children, even animals die. We need to be more loving. We need to care for one another. When you see someone down, help them up. Because one day, that could be you. And one day, that person may see you in that same situation that, that they were in whenever you help them up. And they'll help you up. Don't judge people because of their sexuality. Don't judge people because of who they are. Don't judge people because of their past. Because the me today is not the same me that was 10 years ago. The me today is a different me. Even more different than the me from yesterday. And the week before. We are all human beings. We all need to care about one another. And we all need to love each other. There is no point in hate. What? Why do we judge? Why do we hate people because of the skin color or because of what they believe in or because of their sexual orientation? That should never be something that we hate someone for. We should only judge people by their actions and how they present themselves to us. We need to stop that. And if you're watching this video and you're one of those people who do that, stop. Would you want somebody judging you? Would you want somebody to make fun of you because of what you like? In the bedroom or your race or... Shit, people who watch anime are put down because they watch anime. But then there's people on here who watch certain YouTubers who are just idiots, in my opinion. They don't... People, some, a lot of channels on YouTube don't talk about this, about these things, except for Brandon. I love his channel. Awesome dude. I'll put a link to his channel down below. Y'all can go and check him out. Brandon Rashad. Amazing dude. I've been watching his channel since when he used to wear a beanie on his head. And this dude has always dropped knowledge, always just talked, like, such a caring person. And if we can be more like him... And if we can just see the world as what it's becoming and just be caring people, man, that's all we need is just caring people, people who care, people who don't judge, man, like being some, we're not God, we're not the creator, so we can't judge. You can judge if you want to, but if you're religious and you're judging someone, then you're going against what God believes. Judgment, that's his job, not our job. Let people live their life the way that they want to live. And if you're out there chasing a dream and no one believes in you, just fucking know I love you, bro, and I believe in your dream, and I believe in you completely. You will achieve what you want to achieve. You speak it into existence, it will happen. Speak it into existence, and it will happen. Tell yourself, I will become a millionaire. I will be able to put my family, you know, if you're going through hard times right now, and you have a dream that some people don't believe in, keep telling yourself, I will get to that point where I'll be able to take care of my family and myself and we'll live happy and stress-free. Believe in yourself when no one else does. Believe in yourself. 
and you'll do just fine. You'll do great. Life is not easy. It's a long, hard road with a bunch of bumps. But if you can overcome those bumps and stay in your own lane and keep steering the wheel of life, you'll get to where you want to get to. I promise you that. I never thought I would ever get monetized on YouTube. I tried to get monetized so many times and I got denied. And then finally the other day, it was like last week, when I least expected it. When I least, everything always happens when you don't expect it to happen. It always happens when you don't expect it to happen. I was just chilling in my room. I think I was playing Destiny 2 or Kakarot. I just checked my emails and I got an email from YouTube saying congratulations, you know, you're now part of the YouTube uh, partner program. I was so happy, bro. Three years of pushing out content, getting denied, you know, family questioning me like, oh, are you going to still work this minimum wage job? What are you doing with your life? You're going to be nothing. And now I'm becoming something. Believe in yourself, bro. Believe in yourself. When no one else does, you have to believe in yourself. I hope that someone out there who's watching this video, I hope that if you, you know, if you feel like no one loves you, I love you. I don't care what you are, who you are, race, sexuality, beliefs, religious beliefs. I love you. I love you equally. Everybody. I love everybody equally. I hope you guys have a great day. If you have a dream, like Mr. Miyagi, you can do it. Keep th This is the power of your destiny. No one can no one can make you become anything except for you. This right here, this right here, this skeleton that has this giant thing inside of your brain, I mean inside of your skeleton. The skeleton is to protect your brain. Your brain is the most powerful thing in the universe. Believe in yourself and become what you want to become. Do not become what other people want you to become, but you become what you want to become. I love you guys. I appreciate all the support on this channel. I just feel like I had to get that out. I really do. I just feel like someone had to hear that because I know a lot of people are not accepting of people just because of what they believe in, race, or even sexuality. None of that should ever be a reason to judge someone. I hope you guys have a great day. I hope people out there who are watching this video, who have made it to the end, I hope your dreams come true. I hope you become a fucking millionaire. I hope that you make all the money in the world. I hope that you are able to put your parents in a better place that they weren't able to put themselves in and they gave you everything that they had and they gave you everything that they were able to give you when you were a child. And they gave you the world that they were never given. I hope and I pray that you become successful so you can give them that. I love you guys, and as always, peace out.